It's definitely different, but to be able to help, even if it's a Sunday, I'm here. The backpack program basically helps kids who right now need food that normally gets the food when they come to school. Because unfortunately, some kids don't get home meals and so it's a great way for Sodexo and Nixa to kind of work together with the bus program and everything too to get those meals out to the children. Thank you. Have a good day. This is what we do. This is what's nice about being a lunch lady because we see those kids. We know what those kids go through. We see them every day. Sometimes we see them more than their parents do. You know, we hear their stories and we know their struggles sometimes and it's nice to be able to give back to those kids that, that need us. That's the joy of being a lunch lady. So for breakfast, they're gonna get a cereal, they're gonna get some like little Scooby snacks, you know, like little packs of food, um, a juice. And then for lunch, they're gonna get a sun butter sandwich, a fruit cup, a cheese stick, and some goldfish crackers. You gotta worry about them. I haven't seen them for a week, and you get real attached to them. Because some of them have been on my bus for four years. We were at uh, John Thomas, and then we were over at Century, and then we went down South Street, and I got to see a lot of my elementary kids and their parents. Century is one of my schools, so I got to see some parents there too. Well, we had a list of kids who needed lunch and breakfast, and we had a designated time for them to come and pick them up, and then we would meet them, check them off the list, and when we gave them their breakfast, their lunch, and then milk. That's Jessica. She is the manager over at Inman. So she usually deals with fifth and sixth graders and stuff like that. So yeah, she's working hard on the sun butter sandwiches. Those take a little bit of time, but she's doing great. We've taken our temperature. We're wearing a mask. We're making sure we're washing our hands on a regular basis. We're wearing our gloves. We're just making sure everything is up to compliance and make sure we're all safe. We enjoy what we do. You know, it takes a big heart sometimes to do what we do. And like I said, you know, I'm here on a Sunday away from my family, but it's okay because the city of Nixa is what matters, the kids of this community is what matters, and so as long as they have a meal, that's the end goal. All bus drivers really worry about their kids. I got to see one of the moms, his, her son's not on my bus anymore because he's moved on to the summit. She said he missed me as his bus driver, which was nice. I mean, I graduated from Nixa, so I'm a Nixa native, but you know, so it's nice to be able to give back to the town that I know.